Hello everybody, it's Android Gamer. I'm back with Ancestral Legacy. Let's see where we go from here. So we had uh, sort of dream with uh, the entity August 3rd. I don't feel so bad. Hmm? I look around. I saw my room. <sighs> How am I on my bed? I don't remember last night. <clears throat> Let's go downstairs. My head hurts. I think I had a dream. I feel like I was forced to choose. I feel like I'm, I was being threatened. I think I was make a choice. Hmm, my visit was still good. Was it? <laughs> Are you sure about that? I can hear music coming from Grandma's room. Are you awake? Good morning. Are you okay? Why do you, why are you asking? Miss Lee, don't you remember last night? She looks just as tired as I am. What's going on? No? That's what I was curious about. Something happened last night? Did I do something weird last night? I say like, something happened last night because I, I don't know if it was about me. Last night. You just woke up, right? Yeah? Ma'am has not said anything yet. Housekeeper glanced around the room with the music coming out of it. Don't you remember fainting? Do you remember that? Yeah, we, yeah, I did. Faint? I wonder how much you remember. You saw me leave, right? Grandma told me you finished for the night. That wasn't a dream, right? That's obvious. I then... I left, then heard something, and so I came back. Here's my number, just in case. If something happens, call me. Okay? Anyways, I was so surprised yesterday. Really? Because of me? Either way, I feel bad. Me too. And Grandma. You don't... You didn't do anything wrong. Don't feel guilty. Yet. <laughs> How about, how do you feel anyway, otherwise? Physically, I feel fine. Mentally, I'm a nervous wreck that I don't want to blow. Then I guess that you, I guess that means you didn't hear about 
what happened in the mountain then. Uh, I guess he's in here. Yes. I have to say that one. Oh, have to make choice. I have to make do money. So the game will delete your tickets. Okay. Watch and hand to get 30 tickets and 200 for a dollar. <clears throat> Seems like I'm doing five, five tickets a uh, game, so I'm going to get 200 tickets. Five, five tickets a choice. So one sec. Five, five tickets of choice. Okay. Something happened yesterday? Nothing big. Other than the fact I went in the mountains, found a ghost that, or a spirit that says I'm from a line that I didn't know about. Just that I went into the mountains. Your grandmother told me you not told you not to go. Yeah. That's not the point. I saw a spirit. I now can't I can see fine. Uh there are spirits or shamas or things in the wood in the village. Spirits, shamans. Why are you saying things like this the first thing in the morning? <laughs> well, what else you want me to say? I think you might be confusing him with something else. When did we say him? That's really not something I would do. I'm not trying to scare you, but... Let's see, I shall say spirit. spirit. I felt, I felt weird. Aunt? There isn't anything like that in the village. But, well, on another topic, 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 what's she trying to get at? What other topic? There's something else? Yes, of course. You can't tell anyone. I see dead people. She's really worried. I won't. Don't worry. Then let's talk about it around dinner. Is that okay? Uh, sure? Why dinner? Okay, I'm certain she has her reasons. I'm certain that there'll probably be someone invited to dinner that's gonna tell me the whole story about who I am. And that's also why, because my grandmother's coming out. Dear? Yes, ma'am. What, what the, what's that? Okay, there's the the ties. Grandma? What? You don't see it? Huh? 
Is there something on my face? Kind? The lash sh shook along my mother's... Lee shook along my mother's every word. Do you see something on me? What's going on? Neither one of them can see it. Maybe Grandma is pretending not to know. Maybe I should ask Lee first, just in case. Just a sec. Huh? Hold on a sec, Grandma. Did you happen to see something weird on Grandma? On your grandmother? What? Uh, how should I explain? Um, yeah, she seems to be receptive to it, so I'll say a leash. A leash thing? A leash? What in the world are you talking about? Nope, guess not. I need to tell your grandmother. Let's look at her grandmother. You know, like rope hanging from the front gate? Like the rope hanging from the front gate? Rope like, th like that is hanging around grandmother's neck right now. I didn't see that. I can't be the only one who sees it. You're scaring me. I, I don't know. Uh, what the hell? Are you two done? Grandma, the housekeeper jumps at the sound of Grandma's voice coming from the living room. We'll talk later. Yes, ma'am. It's it was nothing. Yes, Grandma. Why is she so scared of my grandma? Cause she's death come for you. <clears throat> Let's say this one. doing her best to explain it even in the moment. Hi, Karen. I heard everything you said, so let's take a moment and calm down. Since there is something that can't be explained, I will call a doctor tomorrow. Why not call him now? It's, you just got up. What doctor? The witch doctor. Hi, doctor. Shrink. I'll say shrink. <laughs> Makes sense since I've been like this since yesterday. You're right to be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. With me saying I can see better, and I don't really know why, right? It's not that, my dear kind. I'm not being suspicious. I, I'm just worried about you. <clears throat> That's right, Mr. Lee. Your grandmother is only worried. The hug. You don't understand me. 
My head hurts. What's wrong? Do you need help? Did you help me get upstairs? Here, yeah, lean on me. When you aren't strong, follow my lead. Slowly. Have her upstairs. I can hear my grandmother's careful plea. I bought some traditional medicine. Take it later when you get up again. Don't worry too much. I don't want to take your hug. Do what your grandmother asks. At the top of the stairs, the housekeeper takes a look at me. You don't really want to take that mess in, do you? Not if I can help it. But we can't just throw it away. I'll take care of it a little at a time. Take care of it a little time. Is that all right? <clears throat> You're not going to take it for him, are you? Yes, do what you want with it. Your head, how is it? Does it hurt a lot? It's not that it hurts. Uh, I don't know. It feels like someone's squeezing it. But it feels better. But it always feels better. I really don't know. Oh my. Well. We have some pain relievers downstairs, so I'll get it right away. And if it's okay, can I tell you what I said I'll tell you now? Or should I just tell you around supper time, on dinner time? If you can't wait, go ahead. I can still he listen if my head hurts. about yeah it's about me it's not it that's not it but it's about the family so it's probably related I'm not telling on anyone or anything so don't get me wrong it's not about grandmother I won't tell anyone But why are you so afraid of her? Because she's evil. She just, just looks like that. She's actually not scary. Because she's family. What? It's not because... It's because you are family, Miss Lee. That's not the point, though. There's an errand she has me run lately. Yes, you run errands yesterday too. You ran errands yesterday too. Since I'm not a villager, she says absolutely nothing about what goes on in the village. <clears throat> but the errand she sends me on was days... The, these days are scary. She says they're about the village. Scary? Last week, town next to here at a photo studio. Uh, I live in that the town. Well, I went to the photo studio because she sent me to pick up a photo. It was a funeral 
portrait of your of a young lady. To me, you know. No. Why in the world does she need a photo, funeral photo, of a young lady? Because it's of her. She's not really alive. I wasn't trying to look at it, but I was wrapped in paper and I was trying to put an envelope. I saw it by mistake. Anyhow, she sent me on some errands, some strange errands recently. Funeral photo of a strange, complete stranger. It's not a villager, right? I don't know. There aren't many people, young people in the town, so, and we don't in, really interact. Oh no, I must sound crazy. No, not as crazy as talking to a spirit. It's okay. I understand. Silence falls, fills the air for a minute. No, I shouldn't have said anything. I've been working here for a long time, but I made a fuss over nothing. That's nothing, haha. <laughs> I think it's best we both calm down. I did want to tell someone. I talked too much, didn't I? I'm sorry. It's all right. I went on and on. It's okay. I also, I'm also sorry. I got angry and did weird stuff too. I think Grandma's really shocked. I have to apologize later. My head hurts so much. I think I even curse. I understand. Get some rest. I brought pain levers, so take them if you need them. If you need them. Sigh. Okay, I'll lay down now. I heard the innkeeper, or the housekeeper, walk downstairs before passing out. Okay. Uh, I think I'm going to leave this episode here. It's a little short, but... Also a little tired, <laughs> and I didn't get a whole lot of sleep last night, no, no. There, we'll go there. Anyways, uh, if you want to continue the long watch this, please subscribe to my channel. It's Android Gamer, later days, and happy gaming!